Happening this Memorial Day, taps all across America. That's Jeff Westfall from Indianapolis joining the national moment of remembrance by playing his bugle at his flagpole at the same time as countless others did across the country. In Fishers today, the community unveiled a new monument honoring Gold Star families who've lost a veteran during military service. Our Jenny Runovich tonight shows us the tribute in front of City Hall. When a patriot gives their life while serving our country, That sacrifice goes beyond the battlefield. It's also made here at home by loved ones like Noreen Nowak, whose nephew, a U.S. Marine, died in Iraq. In that moment, our family became members of a club to which nobody wants to belong. We became a Gold Star family. The grief of such a loss is indescribable. That's why on this Memorial Day, the city of Fishers dedicated a new monument honoring the Gold Star families fallen heroes leave behind. To advise them of today's dedication, to advise them that that monument, which is their monument, belongs to them. It is healing to be here today. I am proud beyond measure that the good people of Fishers have dedicated themselves not only to remembering our brave fallen heroes, but also their families. The monument paid for with donations features a soldier's silhouette in salute and shadows of the loved ones who feel their loss so acutely. Any family who has lost someone in the defense of our country knows that in Fishers, we take care of our own. In Fishers, we make sure that they've never been forgotten. They never will be forgotten. Also during this ceremony came a personal tribute. Each day I'll do a golden by helping those who are in need. From a member of the greatest generation who fought alongside fallen heroes. We are the fortunate ones who were able, if we were overseas, to come home alive. Those that I served with, so many of them did not come home alive. A solemn reminder of the brave who never took off the uniform. Now it's hoped this memorial. God bless America. Honors those veterans and comforts their survivors who've sacrificed too. My home, sweet home. There's also a memorial now in downtown Indianapolis, specifically for Gold Star families. It's a monument on the northeast side of the American Legion Mall, and it was dedicated earlier this month.